Secrets of Bluegrass Chefs is a presentation of Kentucky Proud. Kentucky's first and finest artisan food hall. This is The Barn at the Summit at Fritz Farm in Lexington, where you'll find all your favorite local flavors under one roof. Get a little something for everybody. It's not your typical food court by any means. At a food court, you're, you're just really getting kind of counter service uh, meals. Here, we really try to have more of an interaction with our guests, and we're really trying to create more of a community feel. Take your pick. Do you want made-from-scratch Greek food at the Athenian Grill? Or how about ice cream made with local cream at Crank and Boom? There's Smithtown Seafood serving fresh fish prepared with all kinds of Kentucky proud ingredients. All of our vegetables, they're sourced out of Lexington, Kentucky. We do a fish and chips, that's really popular, um, as well as the oyster po' boy. On that, you got lettuce, tomato, onion, you have the pickles, um, you got the Weisenberg fried oysters with the remoulade. Um, it's like a spicy tartar sauce, a little bit tangy, and with fries, that's really popular. Maybe you're in the mood for French crepes. They have those at the barn too, at La Petite Creperie, a favorite that began at Lexington area farmers markets. And you can't beat the burgers at Pasture. One of the unique things about Pasture is all of the meats that we serve here are all uh, pasture raised by local uh, Kentucky farmers, and they're all uh, raised without hormones, steroids, or antibiotics. So everything that we serve is just as natural as we could possibly make. Our, certainly our most popular menu item is our uh, Pasture Burger, which is just uh, pasture raised, grass fed, ground beef finished with all the traditional fixings, lettuce, tomato, onion, and pickle. We serve that on a brioche bun with fries, but we also uh, have some really fantastic fried chicken, roasted chicken. We do fried pickles that are just out of this world. And speaking of out of this world food, check out Atomic Ramen. Japanese style ramen, a traditional style with our own flair on stuff. It's food from a world away, but just like all the restaurants in the barn, it's chock full of local ingredients. You know, doing everything by hand, making our own uh, stock every day. Uh, uh, we get our uh, noodles from Lexington Pasta Company. Locals crave Atomic Ramen signature dishes like this one. Our signature bowl called the Uhura. Um, it is a uh, basic shoyu pork ramen, which is a soy sauce, mostly in the flavoring. The other bowl is called the Dracaris, uh, kind of based off the kind of a Game of Thrones reference. Um, it's very spicy. Not everything's atomic, but when we do atomic, it's, it's atomic. <laughs> you come in here and get food from five, six different places. Uh, also, we've got Kentucky for Kentucky's retail shop, so you can get some fun Kentucky-themed stuff there. And then uh, come get some great cocktails or some great whiskey uh, from Whiskey Bear. You heard it right. There's even a bar in the barn and it's full of local brews, fine wines, and craft cocktails, like this one made with tequila called the Bear Necessities. Bear Necessities. And you can bet there are plenty of bourbon drinks too, like this one, the Whiskey Bear Smash, made with muddled mint, bourbon, lemon juice, and syrup. We're gonna put that over some ice into a shaker tin and give it a good shake. Then we're gonna strain it into a highball glass before we add the ice, then we'll add the ice and then we'll just top it off with a little bit of soda and we'll garnish it. And there's a whiskey bear smash. If you're a fan of local artisan food and drink, you can't beat the barn in Lexington. Come early and if you want, stay late. So after the barn closes and everybody stops serving food, we do still have whiskey bear open. We've got a nice patio and the weather's nice for people to sit out. I think you'll agree that is the nicest barn I've ever seen, certainly the most delicious.